everyone today we will do exercise 1.2 of unit 1 that is numbers and number names so let's begin question number 1 is write the following numbers in the place value chart and find the place value of the digit 7 in each case now here some numbers are given we need to write these numbers in the place value chart and then we have to just find the place value of the digit that is digit 7 so first of all we will make a place value chart and we will just begin with the ones place so ones tens hundred thousand ten thousand lakh and ten lakh we will write down these places and here we will write the numbers now the first number is 3756920 so we will start writing the number from the ones place so at ones place we will write 0 then 2 9 6 5 7 and 3 so 3 is at 10 lakhs place and 7 is at lakhs place it means the period of 3 and 7 is lakh so it is 37 lakh 56000 because here the period is 1000 and these places comes under the 1000 period 920 second one is 7062408 So again, we will begin with the ones place. First of all, we will write the last digit that is eight in the ones place. Then zero, four, two, six, zero, and seven. Again, it is seventy lakh sixty-two thousand four hundred eight. Next is two seven zero zero five three. Again, we will begin with the ones place. So the last digit of the number is three. We will write it at ones place. Three five zero zero seven two. So how we are going to read it? Two lakh seventy thousand fifty three. Now the last number is eight seven two five nine six three, and the last digit is three, which we are going to write at the ones place. So three six nine five two seven eight. Now let us read it. Eighty-seven lakh twenty-five thousand nine hundred sixty-three. So this is how we can just place or write the numbers given in the place value chart. Now one by one we will just find the place value of the seven in every number. In the first case, place value of seven in words is seven lakh, and in figures we will write like this. Why seven lakh? Because seven we have written under the lakhs place in the place value chart. Now in the next part, the place value of seven in words is seventy lakh, and in figures it is seventy lakh like this. So again, because here the seven is at ten lakhs place, that is why its place value is seventy lakh. Now in the next part, the place value of seven in words is seventy thousand, and in figures. we can write it like this why because 7 in the place value chart is at 7 10000s place now in the last part the place value of 7 in words is 7 lakh because it is at lakhs place and in figures we can write like this so this is how you can write the numbers in the place value chart and then you can find the place value of the digit which is asked in the question now next is question number Two. Find the place value of three in the number five three two zero five one nine, both in figures and words. So you can just mention the places over this number. So the place value of three in five three two zero five one nine will be first of all. Let us mention the places: one stands hundred, thousand, then ten thousand, lakh, and ten lakh. So in figures. It is. Let us see where three is. Three is at lakhs place. So it is three zero 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 zero. So we can write it like this in figures. Then in words, it is under the lakhs period. So in words, we will write three lakh. So this is how we can write the place value of three in the given number, both in figures as well as in words. So we have to see that under which place this particular number is. written and that will be the place value of the digit next is question number 3 write the following numbers in the expanded form so here i have written it twice so let me cut it 
Now first one is 670534. So when we have to write the expanded form of any number, it means we need to write the place value of each and every digit in the number. So let us see. First of all, we can write the first digit that is 6 and then we have to count how many numbers are after this digit. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we can put 5 zeros. Why? Because the place value of 6 in this number is 6 lakh. Then we will come to 7. So write down 7 and then count the number of digits after 7. So there are 4 digits. So the place value of 7 in this number is 70,000. Then it is 0. We can leave it. After that next is 5 and 5 is at 100's place. So there are 2 digits after 5. So we can put 2 zeros after 5. Next is 3. 3 is at 10's place and after 3 it is only 1 digit. So we will write 1 zero with 3. And the digit at the 1's place is 4. So it will be written as a single digit. And between each and every number we have to use the sign of addition. Because whenever we will add all these place values we will get this number by adding the, all these numbers. Fine. Now similarly you will do the remaining parts. Part B is 403200. First of all write down the first digit and then see how many numbers are after this. So there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 digits. So we will put 5 zeros. It means the place value of 4 here is 4 lakh. Then 0 we can leave. Next is 3. Place value of 3 is 3000 there are three digits after it so we will put three zeros and next is two two is at hundreds place there are two digits after two so we will put two zeros and now we have written the expanded form of this number now next is part c 7820067 so similarly we will do part c and part d we will write the place value of each and every digit which is given there in the number so here the place value of seven is 70 lakh then place value of 8 is 8 lakh then zeros we can leave after 8 next is 2 so what we will do we will write the place value of 2 which is how much 20 thousand then comes 6 because 0 we can leave so place value of 6 is 60 because there is only one digit after 6 so we will put 1 0 and last one is 7 so this is how you can write the place value of this number and this is the expanded form of this number fine now next one is part d 909005 so similarly we will do this part first of all write the place value of 9 it is 9 lakh because there are 5 digits after 9 so we will put 5 zeros then 0 we can leave next again it is 9 it is at thousands place there are 3 digits after it so we will put 3 zeros to make it thousand and again we can leave the zeros last one is 5 so write down it here so this is the expanded form of this number now next is question number 4 and it is write the following numbers in the expanded form and find the place value of the digit 9 in each case now here we have to write the place well first of all we have to write the expanded form of the given number then we need to find the place value of 9 so first of all you will write the expanded form as we have done in the previous question and then you will find the place value of 9 so here the place value of 9 is what it is lakh so you can write it in figures as well as in words as you like it fine so the place value of 9 is 9 lakh next is part b 9503520 so first of all you will write the expanded form and then place value of 9 which is 90 lakhs similarly part c 495604 so write the expanded form and then the place value of 9 which is 90000 and similarly part d 3070590 here first of all you will write the expanded form and then place value of 9 which is 90 next is question number 5 find the place value of the digit in the boxes so the first number is 5369521 so for finding the place value what you can do you can write the number which is there in the box and then count the number of digits after it so there are four digits we will put four zeros here 
and we can see that place value of 6 which is in the box is 60,000 or you can mention the places fine like this now similarly part B 9256143 here in the box the digit is 9 so we need to find the place value of 9 so write 9 and count the number of digits after it and put that many zeros here fine or you can mention the places over it and then you can see what is the place value of 9. So here the place value of 9 is 90 lakhs. Now next is 700489. So again you will just write the digit in the box and count the number of digits after it and put that many zeros here. And you can see the place value of 4 here is 400 because 4 is at 100's place. Next is question number 6. Find the digits in the required place in each of the following. So we need to find the digit. So 10 lakhs in 580703. So which digit is at 10 lakhs place in this number? So we can mention the places over this number. 1s, 10s, 100, 1000, 10,000 lakh and 10 lakh. Now we can see at 10 lakhs place, what is the digit? So it is 5. Fine. Because 5807093 has 58 lakhs. So the digit in 10 lakhs place is 5. So you can write like this. Now similarly, part B. So lakhs in 5298760. Which digit is at lakhs place in this number? So we will just mention the places 1, 10s, 100. 1000, 10,000 and this is lakh. So this number has 52 lakhs. So the digit at lakhs place is 2. So we can write it like this. Now next is question number 7. And question number 7 is write the following numbers in the short form. So here in the question the expanded form of the number is given. We need to add all these place values or the numbers to write the short form. Fine. So first of all you will write the first number that is 5 lakh then 70,000 then 3,000 then 200, 40 and 7 then you can add all these numbers and you will come to know that what is the short form of this expanded form. It is 5,73,247. Next is part B and the expanded form here is given. We will just mention the place values above and then we can write the numbers one by one and then we can add it to find the short form fine so here you will add 1 lakh then 30,000 4,000 30 and 2 and the short form will be 1 lakh 34,000 30 2. And whenever you are going to add or subtract any number start writing the numbers from the ones place now next is part C now again an expanded form is given. Write the place values and then start putting the values that is numbers. So first one is 80 lakh. Start writing from the ones place. Then next is 5 lakh. Again start writing from the ones place. Then it is 3460 and then start addition from the ones place only. So what is the short form that you will get? 85 lakh 3400 60. So dear students, I hope you would have understood this exercise. Thank you.